Hey guys, welcome back to Economics and Comics. So, if you're new to the channel, this is my hot covers only uh, for 11, 14, 18, new comic book day. So what I'm going to be doing is Sundays, I'm going to bring you my hot covers only. On Monday, I am going to try to bring you the keys of the week for that upcoming Wednesday. Tuesday, I will be doing like a live look at the comics in my hand. I'll go through them, make sure there's some keys in there and all that, and, and tell you about any other keys that I find. And then Wednesday morning will be new comic book day for the week ahead, so you can get a jump on it. And that's how we're going to do all this comic, new comic book day stuff. So, last video I made for new comic book day, uh, I added some stars and stuff to it. This time, I'm going to add a fire symbol. So they're going to be one, two, and three in regard to relevance. Three fires is, dude, try to pick it up. It's going to be hot. Um, also, we're going to be doing a Facebook live auction on the 17th, which is next Saturday. So make sure to go to my little links up at the top I, where it says Economics and Comics. On the right side, there's uh, all the links for all my little things. Go ahead and like and follow my Facebook. You're not going to want to miss it. We have great auctions, and I'm going to have a local artist here as well. And like you know how we do it, if you've been there before. So this week, I'm going to start with just one star or fire symbol. I'm going to do all the ones. Then I'm going to do the twos, and then I'm going to do the fire hot ones at the end, okay? So here we go. First up, we have God of War number one. Now, a local guy, well, at least to be local, Tony Parker's doing the art for it. And it looks pretty good. We got William Gibson, Aliens, uh, like the number three movie, number 1A, Christmas cover. Mr. Miracle, number 12, cover B, by Jared's or Gerard's. Plastic Man, number six. Supergirl, number 24, variant cover B, by Connor. Wonder Woman 58 by the Dodson family, Terry and his wife, or yeah, that's right. Uh, let's see, Lone Ranger number two cover A by Cassidy. Uh, looks kind of interesting. Euthanauts number four cover A. Beauty number 25 cover B. Gideon Falls number eight cover A. Now. Just so you know, this is according to my tastes. Usually the ones that I think are the most relevant at the end of the video, they usually command a pretty good price on eBay or wherever else later on that week. That's why I'm telling you now, so you can pick them up for cheap somewhere or put them on your pool list so you don't have to pay that extra money. Uh, we got Rose number 14 cover C, it's a rate cover. And Weatherman number 6B by Martin. Amazing Spider-Man 9A, covered by Ramos. Let's see here. Daredevil, number 611. Fantastic Four, number 3, cover A. Thor, number 7, the Del Mundo, cover A, cover. Uh, could be a 2, I'm going to give it a 1. Dark Ark, number 11A. And Bloodshot Rising Spirit number 1A, which is cover A. So, uh, you know, a lot of you might not agree with my, what I think is hot. I just, I don't know if I have an art, artistic eye or not, but I whatever pops to me, I like. Now, I could miss a couple things, too, here and there, but I'm trying to give you the best. So let's move on to the two covers, okay? Like the two fire, like medium, right in the middle. Okay, for my second tier, we're going to start with American Gods, My Angel, number 8B, Dave and Matt cover. It's pretty nice. Uh, Detective Comics, number 992, Del Lotto. Del Lotto's here. I think he might be taking Brooks's place in the variant cover realm for that book. Hawkman, number 6B, by Scalera. Let's see. 
Superman number 5B Adam Hughes cover. I really like it, but I'm going to give it a two star in, in regard to relevance. Uh, it could be hot, though. Just keep your eye out there. Titans number 29 cover B by Yasmin Putri. And believe me, it was hard to give some of these twos. Uh, Wonder Woman number 58B by Jenny Friesen. Hit Girl number 10A by Albuquerque. I really like this one. And cover C by Burnham. Uh, we also have Avengers number 10 celebrating their 700th issue. I like, and there's a bunch of variants, guys. I'm just going to give you what I think. Um, and I'm sure there's some really hot ones too. But these are what might or may or may not be achievable. These are incentive covers, though. This is the uh, Adams, the Perez and Adams variant cover. It's like the old 100 cover. Um, also, Black Order number 1B looks pretty cool. Um, Captain America, the regular cover for number 5 by Alex Ross. Hard to give Ross two, but we got to. Fantastic Four 3B. Uh, that is a nice one. Peter Parker, number 312, the regular cover. Thor, number 7, Variant, by Greg Land. Uh, let's see. X-Men, number 1. Real quick. There's a lot of covers. There's a lot of covers. I'm just going to give you one. I'm giving it a 2 by Marco. It's X-Men, number 1, cover D. Kind of like it. And believe me, there's tons. Everyone's going to say, oh, what about this, that? Just forget it. Let's just pretend they didn't do 10,000 covers and save me a little bit of time on this one this week. Everyone's going to get one. Who knows what it's going to be, though. Uh, Venom number 8 by Stegman's pretty cool. And uh, Bloodshot uh, Rising Spirit number 1 cover B by David Mack. So now I'm going to get to my super hot ones, okay? Don't forget to subscribe and like and check out my other uh Social media things, Facebook, Instagram, Patreon, whatever. Okay, here we go. Okay, guys, here's your top dogs. I'm going to go in reverse. So, Venom number eight, cover B by J. Scott Campbell. Love it. Love it. We have Fantastic Four, number three, cover D by J. Lee. That's a nice one. Uh, Domino number eight regular cover is hot, man. Uh, looking looking good. And some of these might not be attainable, guys. Um, I know I'm not going to get them all. It really sucks, but they're you know they're expensive. Cosmic Ghost Runner number five, the variant J. Scott Campbell cover. And I think that's the last one. Uh, Black Order number one cover C by Yuck Lee. He's been doing all those Spider Gun connecting covers. And that's a nice one, too. Okay, this is a real big one. I, if you can get it, get it. I, I love this cover. Avengers number 10, Alex Ross incentive cover. I think it's like 50 bucks. And that's a tough one. If they have it at the shop and it looks good, get it. But ordering it from some other company, that is just it's sketchy. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man number 9, cover B by Clayton Crane. I love it. <laughs> I love it. Okay, here we go. And you hear this every week, guys. Red Hood Outlaw, number 28, cover B by Yasmin Putri. It just barely made my three-star list, but I have a feeling it's going to look pretty good. Suicide Squad, number 48, cover B by Matina. I'm wondering if these covers are going to all connect or something, because they all kind of look similar, but they're really cool. And... Gosh, it's hard to do this. But no, it's not hard to do this. Uh, Catwoman, number five, cover B variant by Art Term is absolutely gorgeous. So, 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 what do I think? Man, this is tough. What's attainable? That's the first question. What's attainable? Domino number eight is attainable, and it's good. Um, what is attainable? 
Venom number eight, cover B by J. Scott Campbell, is possibly attainable at your local comic book shop. Uh, as well as Amazing Spider-Man number nine, cover B, is possibly attainable at Clayton Crane. Now, usually, well, the Red Hood Outlaw cover B is attainable, 28 by Putri. But you're going to have a hard time finding these three books, okay? I think. The Catwoman number 5 cover B Archer is going to be hard to get unless you go early. As well as the Suicide Squad number 48 cover B. And then the hardest one, I think, is the Avengers number 10, Alex Ross incentive cover. But that is gorgeous. Dang it. Between Catwoman and, and Avengers 10, Ross, I'm giving it to the Avengers 10 incentive Ross cover this week. It is gorgeous. And, and Catwoman 5, uh, our term, is just right there. But, you know, oh, man. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys can pick up some of these books. Any of them are good as far as concerned in my eyes. And uh, we'll see you next time, okay? Bye-bye.